जय गुरुदेव स्टूडेंट्स अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू इन आर प्रीवियस क्लास आई हैड एक्सप्लेन वॉट इज द रोल ऑफ आई सी टी इन आर डेली लाइफ आई होप द टॉपिक वॉज क्लियर टू यू ऑल नाउ टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन आई सी टी टूल्स आई सी टी टूल्स आर डिजिटल डिवाइसेज दैट आर यूज टू कम्युनिकेट इंफॉर्मेशन विद अदर्स वॉट आर टूल्स थ्रू विच वी आर एबल टू कम्युनिकेट और to send the information from one place to another place these include mass communication ICT like press radio and television as well as interactive ICTs like computers laptop desktop tablets smartphone data projector software program emails printers scanners and interactive teaching boxes etc let us learn about some ICT tools here smartphone is mentioned this is very familiar for for you all because nowadays through online classes you are able to take your online class through your smartphone right students so what is a smartphone let's have uh, a look a smartphone a popular ICT tool is a multi purpose mobile computing device underline this term students here multi purpose mobile computing device why it is mentioned multi purpose and why it is mentioned mobile computing device because you all know nowadays in a smartphone a number of facilities are available which are available in your computer or in your laptop so with the help of your smartphone you are able to use ms office suite means your excel powerpoint M M S Word etc. So you are able to create documents also with the help of your device. Having a rechargeable battery and touch screen features, it allows touch screen. You all know students with the help of your fingertips, you are able to touch the screen and uh, you know, just open the files or scroll it and so on. it allows users to make voice and video calls you all have done this how you are able to make voice call or video call with the help of your smartphone send text messages that is called chat also and emails capture images and videos play games play media and connect to internet services through cellular bluetooth and wifi networks A smartphone are effective learning tools for students students can use smartphone for the following purpose you all know for which purpose a student can use a smartphone first is to download and read ebooks journals magazines newspapers etc very beneficial is your ebook students because nowadays you are not able to purchase the books right so a number of books are available on your e portal so e book portal is very important uh, site where you will log in and you will read a number of books of different different writers second is to communicate with their teachers classmates or friends through email sms instant messaging social networking voice and video calling etc this is very true students video calling with the help of google meet you are able to attend your live class social networking the example is facebook chatting with the help of uh, whatsapp you are able to chat with your friends you are able to take your classes through whatsapp also now to send or receive multimedia documents what is multimedia documents mm, just before few days or few weeks you have given your periodic test students so your periodic test copies you have sended it online so how you have sent it all the copies with the help of pdf the is uh, for teachers that all the pages are there in a single pdf file we are able easily able to check the copies or pages of yours pdfs etc there are meant for educational purpose to access the internet to surf thousands of educational sites on the www and so on students here one more term is mentioned that is new for you surf what is surf what is surfing 
सर्फिंग हैव यू एवर लिसन दिस टर्म सर्फिंग मीन्स विजिटिंग द वेब पेजेस और मूविंग फ्रॉम वन वेब पेज टू अनदर वेब पेज इट इज नोन एज वेब सर्फिंग नो हेयर वन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टर्म इज मैंशन द लेटेस्ट स्मार्टफोन द लेटेस्ट स्मार्टफोन कम विद एडवांस फिंगर प्रिंट सेंसर्स यू मस्ट हैव सीन विट एट द बैक साइड फिंगर प्रिंट सेंसर्स मस्ट बी देयर when you are going to when you have given your fingerprint then after nobody is able to open your smartphone with his or her finger gps navigation integrated virtual assistants high speed internet access and mobile payment features now next is tablets tablets a tablet computer or simply tablet is a portable handheld computer that provides mobile device facility with a rechargeable battery here one again new term i found that is portable what is portable students easy to carry due to its size easily you are able to take it from one place to another place that is known as portable okay having an 8 inch or larger lcd touch enable screen it resembles a smartphone and use an on screen keyboard what is on screen keyboard you all have seen instead of your keypad one on screen keyboard is available with the help of your fingers you are able to type instead of physical keyboard to enter input okay tablets can be used to access the internet read and send emails play video games listen the music watch videos read e notes chat use applications and much more since a tablet has a larger screen it helps students to read digital content such as ebook with comfort students i think uh, through your smartphone you must face a little bit problem but when you are going to use tablets instead of your smartphone definitely the contents will be much and more clear students can also use this video to exchange information to communicate to access the internet to make social group groups to fill in the online examination forms and do much more i hope it is clear to you all now next is radio what is radio you must familiar you must know about radio radio is a technology that uses radio waves to carry information such as sound The radio waves are transmitted through a transmitter and received through a radio receiver also called a radio. The radio also needs an antenna to transmit and receive radio waves. At the receiving end the broadcast waves are re uh, received and their information sound is amplified through the radio receiver. students have you seen uh, this type of radio which is mentioned or given in this figure two buttons were there one is for volume and another is for frequency matching and how it works it works with the help of radio waves or infrared waves uh, through satellite suppose uh, in, on earth station a number of earth stations are there through satellite earth stations will receive the messages or the waves and it will transmit to the radio immediate when you are going to move your frequency button whenever it exactly match to the exact frequency the voice or the song will be clear i hope you have feel this or you must have the experience of doing this next is television you all have television at your homes so television is a traditional means of mass communication that has been in use since the early 20th century it is an audio visual device very important what is audio visual audio visual means pictures are also there clippings are also there and you are also able to hear the voice but radio is only audio device right that people used uh, people used to watch news educational and entertainment programs like serials movies sports etc etc that are broadcast on various television channels today the television is an important icd tool that teachers students journalists and researchers use to enhance their knowledge on 
various topics yes students television is very important for education sector but you must know the channels that where it is important for you and where it is uh, broadcasting the educational chapters right next is email email that stands for electronic mail is a system of sending and receiving text or multimedia messages via computer smartphone or any other modern modern electronic device that uses the internet students email that is electronic mail what is mail earlier you must listen in hindi we can say patra okay letter so mail what is mail pehle ke time mein kya hota tha ki whenever you want to transmit your message or send any birthday invitation to your friend then you have to post it through the post office and after some days the particular invitation will reach to the destination it might be possible ki aapka birthday bhi wahan se khatam ho jata tha aur fir aapke relatives ko aapka invitation milta tha but nowadays with the help of email within a second you are able to convey your message to your relatives either they are in india or out of india also is it clear now did you know one fact is mentioned web refers to the internet the internet is the most effective ict tool that has information about almost every topic have you ever google students you just tap on the mic and whatever the information you want from google you just go through it and it will fulfill all the uh, requirements of yours people can use it to find information about any the topic any of the topic of their choice in the form of text audio and video okay students thank you